Futuro y Tosimas! Yo, what is up, YouTube? Welcome back to the channel. Today we're getting back to some more Legend of Arceus. Um, if you guys missed the last episode, go check it out. It was a very important episode. Um, I almost, I was, I was really trying to evolve my Pokemon. Didn't know how to, but all I had to do was go to the menu and then press, press the Pokemon that was about to evolve and then press evolve. Why doesn't it just evolve when it, when it reaches that level? I don't know why. But yeah, uh, not going to complain. But yeah, uh, I was trying to go back and uh, just to, uh, I don't know. And I just and I just started an event. So yeah, I was like, okay, I guess I'm recording another episode. Because original, the original plan was not to record anymore today. But too late, I'm already recording. And what do you have there? Can it be? Are those two the favorite plates of old? Please let me have a look. Oh, just letting you know, um, I caught a gold bat. I was going to switch out my team. That was the whole reason about coming here. Um, it's level 22, so I'm going to add it to the team. I see there are some letters carved into them. Let's see. This one says, where all creation was born, that is the being place of origin. Okay. It seems to be a phrase from a very old myth. How did you come across these? I see. So the, you were given the plates when you were impressed Weird Ear and Cleavar. That is quite something indeed. My, let me, let me move this closer. That is quite something indeed. My heart is practically racing with excitement. It is my, it is my guess that you will find more plates like these scattered across the Sui. If we were to gather them all and decipher the script on them, we may uncover something. Absolutely amazing. The mysterious of the past. Oh, how they tickle my curiosity. What a joy to be alive and at such times. What if this guy ends up being, like, evil? That'd be kind of fucked up. Well, I must be on my way until next time. Stop waving your finger in my fucking face, my guy. All right, well, let's go over here. Because I'm about to change the team up. Change name? Oh. Uh, well, whether it's a boy or girl, I always name a Vulcan. <sighs> All right. Uh, Vulcan. I'm not going to nickname anybody else because they're just on the team just so I don't keep on dying. Because I'm only using new Pokemon. But now I have a level 22 Pokemon. Um, and now I... Where do I have to go now? I have to go here. These people are probably like, why is this guy freaking doing somersaults in the city? Like, what's wrong with him? I wish you can do like just dash. That'd be nice. But yeah, I got Quilava evolved. I got uh, Shinx evolved. Or I got Cyndaquil, Shinx, and Starly evolved. So yeah, now everyone's at the second stage. Oh, nope, I have to go above. Whew. Motherfucker. Oh, these are fucking... Alright. Yep, there we go. That's where we have to go. Yep, we have to go up here. Oh, I'm just seeing all these fucking white things and I'm just like, where the fuck do I go? <laughs> well done. I've already received the reports of Greg's place. You, success you successfully quilled Cleavor's frenzy, restoring peace to the mind of Sui's people. You are a stranger to us, one who fell out of the very sky. Okay, how many, how many fucking times are you guys going to say, I fell out of the sky, I fell out of the sky, you got, you're a stranger, blah, blah. Like, can you stop saying that? <laughs> you're just sounding like a broken record at this point. But things are not settled yet. I received where there are other Pokemon nobles fa falling prey to such frenzies elsewhere in his duty, okay? So carry on with the research and survey. Okay, cool. I wonder how many hours this game is. I'm gonna search it up. Bad job, okay. Is something else you'd recommend? I'm gonna bring it out, okay. So we're not used to like just like story wise games like this. I dare say to show you very okay, yep. 
Cleaver moved in battle from what I've heard. I want to see how many hours this game is. On average, though, players should expect around 30 hours to beat. Okay. That's not really that long, to be honest. Well, no, no, actually, that's, that's a decent amount. That's, I mean, to be honest, somebody can beat that, like, in three days, so. Oh, by the way, why not try crafting some of these? I made a recipe based on the directions Benny gave me. Smoke bombs. I'm down for some smoke bombs. And now we need to worry about uh, being mauled by Cleaver. Yeah. Let's take our chance to study all the Pokemon of Call Up City and Fertilands. They're home. Uh, Detroit? I've been waiting for you, Detroit. My name's Vanessa. There's something real important I need to tell you. Would you come with me? If this little girl jumps me, I'm gonna slap the shit out of her. I do not care. <sighs> um, this is kind of a secret, but something terrible has happened. Suey is in a whole lot of danger. Hundreds of years ago, a being that brought calamity to the region was sealed away by someone using the power of strange magic. But now, for some unknown reason, the magic has come undone. The seal is broken. I hate to think what might happen at this rate. At that rate, so please, Detroit, hear me out. I need to restore the broken seal. Tell me what to do. Spare tomb. Oh, thank you. I'm so happy you believe me. I just knew you'd be willing to help. Yep, spare tomb. Keep it safe. I fucking knew it. After the seal is broken, the whole bunch of wisps scatter across the Sui. A hundred, a hundred and seven of the what the fuck? Okay, without a key I gave you, you'll be able to gather them all. So this is a fucking uh like Zygarde kind of shit where you find like the little pieces to make a Pokemon. See, the wisps are normally vis invisible, but not to the holder of the odd keystone. Oh. I know it's a huge task, but please, you just have to gather all the wisps for me. It's really, real close to where we are now. How about you start with that one? Um, okay. Oh. Okay, so this is just a collectible kind of thing. I'm trying to go get it. Where are you going? You need to touch the wisp. What the f oh, I forgot there's a bridge. I forgot. So does it run or just stay there? Is it in my soul now? Has been absorbed into the odd keystone just as... Okay, thank God. I thought it was absorbed into me. Thank goodness I picked you to help me with this. Okay. If you ever need fine, Okay, cool. Um, no, I'll be fine. I'll just look online. That's why we have the internet. Yeah, you don't know what that is, but, uh, I have a phone. And only me in this world. Nobody else. God gave it to me. <sighs> the next day... <laughs> well, the Galaxy hairdresser really gets there, I say. Oh, hey, you're Detroit, the boy who quilled Cleaver, aren't you? Uh, that's me. I knew it. You got a quite the reputation, you know. Why, thank you. I mean, you quilled one of the Almighty Sinos' chosen ones. Some people are actually kind of scared of you for doing something so bold. I'm a re Arizu, by the way. I'm a ward of the Diamond Clan. My special skill is to give a haircut. Is giving haircuts. Real nice to meet you. Why do I feel like she's going to be uh, Hasui and Zorark's um, warden? Oh, Snip. I was about to say Simp. But I came here to talk to you about... To your Mr. Kamado. Kamado. However he's... How the fuck you say it? See you around... All right, well, um, what I'm about to do is, actually, let's go here. 
Uh, yeah, Nero style. Let me see what we what we can do. Because uh, that bad head ain't doing so well. Go on and have uh, yourself a seat. I'll put your things. Okay, cool. Now then, my dear, what sort of look would you like to do, go for today? Short. No, that's off. Girl's hair. Curled, no. Hey, oh, I'm not going to lie. That's actually kind of... Oh my god, my eyebrows. Uh, I might just have to go with... Uh, yeah, I might just have to go with black. I mean, yes, I do have like a man bub, but I don't have a ponytail. So I might have to go with this. Because like, it's it's close enough. It got like, it got like the side shaves and stuff. So it's close enough. Uh... Oh, no, shit. All right. Here you go. Have your $500. Yeah, I do like my hair better. I'm not going to lie. It's, it's, at least, it's at least decently close to what I have. Uh, leave it off. Cause I'm not gonna lie. Ever since uh, Sun and Moon came out, uh, I haven't been wearing hats anymore. Um, what's this area? Oh, this is like berries and apricorns. Yeah, I kind of want to buy something. All right, so I can buy these. Oh, shit, I don't have enough money. So I can't sell. That's a shame. Um, Where do I go? Where do I go? Where do I go? <sighs> Actually, hold on. I should go see if they have outfits. Because I'm like, might as well. What the fuck? Who cares? Um, outfits, outfits. Where is she? Right there. Whew. Did I buy any outfits from you? Okay, I guess I just keep on getting special gifts. So I just keep on getting special parcels? Buy clothings. So these are the only hats I can get. Oh no, I can get a lot more. Hey, Shinx, okay. Oh, I kind of like the headband, not gonna lie. I look like a ninja. All right, cool. So hopefully we can do the next, um, what's it called? This suggests that even Pokemon that are not nobles can become frenzied. I I have received no word from Adamant or Irida, but this is now something we can simply ignore. In any case, we have my you have my thanks, Miss Irizu. You did well to inform us of Ursaluna's. I'm sorry, what? I'm I'm sorry, what? Ursa Luna. I knew it. I knew that was the name. This is Ursa Rang's evolution. So this is a brand new Pokemon that I've never seen before. Ursa Luna's warden is Mistress uh, Caliba of the Pearl Clan, is it not? So I've never seen this uh, person. Of all the wardens, she is the most narrow-minded, um, bound by tradition. She likely does not take kindly to outsiders meddling in her affairs. Oh, so that's going to be a problem. 
I have a new mission for you. Of, of, of course. Let the outsider deal with it. Let the outsider deal with the most stubborn person and maybe racist. We don't know yet. But we don't like racism in Pokemon games, so. Next area you will be sent to investigate is Crimson Myrlands. You will find the Pokemon living there to be more fearsome than those in the Obsidian uh, Fieldlands. Even the landscape itself is harsher, with steep rava uh, ravines and seaside cliff. It is now welcoming. Oh, okay. You must be a second star to face this Mer Myrlands. Complete research test of how fill in the Pokedex if you hope to move up in the ranks. Do so by catching Pokemon and conducting your survey work in areas you currently have access to. Okay. So, okay then. Um, ah, fuck it. Um... Might as well get everybody up to level, like, 20 at least. Alright, so let's see what we have to do. Alright, so... Times you use flame wheel, okay. Okay, so I just keep on using my attacks. Go here. Oh, my chest is so itchy. Alright. Uh, we're here. Come on out. Fly! And use flame wheel. Nice critical hit. Let's fight you and then let's do a uh, strong at style of uh, ember. Because we need to get some of yours up as well. Or we need to get some of yours checked off. You're level five. You ain't doing shit. It's a good thing I'm not Nuzlocke. Watch some people actually try to Nuzlocke this game. Personally, I will never Nuzlocke a game for the for the very first time. The only reason why I did it with Brilliant Diamond was because it was an exact remake, and the levels were exactly the same. So I I, I knew what I was I knew what I was getting myself into. So that was the only reason why. But like a game like this, not gonna happen. Uh, come on, you're shanks. You're level six. You should not be dodging my attacks. Oh, all right. Um, uh, fuck it. Agile Ember. Alright, let's see now. Uh, fight. Fuck it, Flamethrower. I might as well get some more items since I'm around them. Oh, you know what? Actually, um, let's go. Let's go try to defeat some alpha Pokemon. 
Because I know that there's a Rapidash around here somewhere. Haha. -ha. I wonder if I can try to capture it. Jesus Christ, this thing looks so like menacing. Oh, let me see something. Uh turn around. Oh my god, can you please look the other way? Right up the ass. <laughs> I kinda figured. Oh god almighty. Oh my god! No, 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 no. Hell no. Hell no. Hell no. Not dealing with that shit. Nope. Bizies. Love you, mister. Not really, bitch. Fuck you. Jesus Christ. Alright, cool. I caught a worm pole. Yay. You're gonna die, bitch. I th I think I'm actually because I'm not really gonna be doing anything for a while until I uh, rank up. So I think I'm just gonna end this off here and then just rank up and then um, I'll continue the story uh, when I'm ranked up. So yeah, if you guys like this video, hit that like button down below. Thank you guys so much for watching. I really do appreciate it. Um, between this episode and next episode, I'll probably get some side quests done while I'm trying to rank up. Just so I can like level up faster. So yeah, uh, thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Remember, hit that subscribe button, hit that like button, and hit that bell. They're all it's always free. So that's why I always do for other subscribers, cause like it's always a nice thing to do. Like show them some love if you like watching their videos. But yeah, thank you guys for watching. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.